Hello viewers, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hopefully you all will be fine. Like before again I bring the some excited news of the Iraqi dinar. So guys today we will discuss about the latest exchange rate of the Iraqi dinar, revaluation of the Iraqi dinar and the announcement from the Central Bank of Iraq about Iraqi dinar exchange rate and the 25,000 note. So guys without wasting time we start the video. If my video is helpful for you please like and subscribe my channel. I pray for you all. Good give you long life, good health and wealth and the best of luck. Hello everyone. Welcome back to Iraqi Dinar, your go-to channel for the latest updates and insights on the Iraqi currency. I'm Ali, and today we have some exciting news and intriguing updates to discuss. We've just been informed by a reliable source that if nothing changes, banks will see liverets in the morning. Time will tell what this means, but let's dive into the details and what this could signify for us. First off, let's address a common question. If the rate is $3.22 and you go to the bank to exchange a 25,000 IQD note into American dollars, how much will you get? Simple math tells us you'd receive $3.22 multiplied by 25,000, which equals $80,500. Exciting, right? But wait, let's clarify something crucial. Deleting the zeros has nothing to do with the exchange rate. Deletion of the zeros simply means removing currency notes with multiple zeros on them. It's an important step towards stabilizing the economy and setting the stage for future growth. Here's some excellent news. According to COO World, a leading business magazine, Iraq will have the fifth largest economy in the Arab world in 2024 with a GDP of $65.90 billion. This is fantastic news for IQD investors. It's essential to understand that currency value and exchange rate are two different things. Changing the exchange rate does not create value. Value is established by the monetary policies set by the Central Bank of Iraq, CBI, and the Iraqi government. These policies need to foster an economic environment that supports the value of the dinar and keeps the economy thriving. Inflationary zeros will be removed because the government has met the CBI's requirements and created an economic environment that will sustain the dinar's value. New lower denomination notes will replace the higher denomination ones. Once this happens, the exchange rate will reflect the new value of the Iraqi dinar. When they remove the three zeros from the exchange rate, the dinar will gain new value. They will float the currency and redenominate it, eventually leading to an RV revaluation. This process is a critical part of Iraq's economic strategy. There's so much going on this morning, and many rumors are swirling about the new rate. But remember, until we can go to the bank and see it ourselves, take these rumors with a grain of salt. What does this mean for our investment? Does this have a negative, positive, or neutral effect? Well, according to Maza Mohammad Saleh, Iraq's cash reserves are at their highest and there are no fears of the dollar rising. This is undeniably good news. As always, your thoughts and insights are invaluable. What do you think about these developments? Share your opinions in the comments below. Do you believe Iraq is on the right track? What steps should they take next? Thank you for joining me today. Remember, the journey towards economic stability and growth is ongoing. Stay tuned for more updates and in-depth discussions on global economic developments. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe. Catch you in the next video.